because the technology that it employs allows you to program the teeth to such a specific position. It allows the doctor to consider all things in finishing a case in terms of what is required for the patient, how the teeth should fit, how they should look, where those teeth should be in the patient's face. And when we do all those things at the beginning, then we can get to the end quicker and it's a more satisfying experience for both the doctor and the patient. Insignia lets me sleep at night. I don't worry anymore if I can fix something. I know I can. It gives me confidence. I, I feel so reliable for my patients to provide that service to them. I saw a Damon speaker at the AO uh, and I thought to myself, I want to do that. The cases that they showed and the results uh, where I knew that I was not happy with so many treatment finishes that I was getting uh, and I knew I could do better that when someone shows you something and it's better, you need to follow that path and you need to find out for yourself and prove to yourself this is valid or it isn't. There's nothing really scientific, truly scientific about orthodontics at all. I, I used to speak for 3M just to staff about uh, uh, staff issues, management and practice management issues and I never showed clinical cases at any of those meetings, although I was proud of my work but it just wasn't my niche. And when I came to uh, the Insignia Core meeting and I met so many of the speakers who were there, um, and I just felt like, you know, I had something good to say, uh, to explain, because I felt like when I started, which is almost five years ago, not a lot of people were doing it. People didn't really understand it. And the more I used it and the more I learned about it, the more passionate I became that, you know, we really needed teachers to get the doctors up to speed. If I could share what I knew in my learning curve to make someone else's learning curve better and shorter, that would be great. And so that just inspired me to sort of tackle, you know, teaching from a different standpoint. Oh my goodness, this is one of the most exciting times to be an orthodontist. I, I would think that when straight wire appliance came out with the evolution of bonding, that if somebody who fit their bands and pinch the bands and place them on every single tooth and painfully for the patient and vent heavy wires with heavy forces and hurt the teeth and hurt the patient, continued what they were doing and ignored what was happening, that they that would be similar to the leap between just going along with your practice with conventional, uh, traditional braces and ignoring what is happening with Damon and Insignia. The technology that is available is a light year ahead of what is traditionally and, you know, for the most part being used most everywhere. So being ahead of the curve and being aware of what is going on has already been demonstrated historically with people who continue to use heavy forces and bands and just sort of fade away, you know, as opposed to people who picked up the direct bonding technology and moved forward. And that's similar at this time in history. It's such an opportunity to grab. It's very exciting. This forum, it was such an honor to be asked to speak here. Uh, it's a very prestigious uh, group of people. Uh, it's very advanced thinkers. Uh, these doctors have so much to offer. They're very engaging. Uh, they're highly critical of themselves of everything that is around, that they, they're critical thinkers and that they can see things and distinguish things and have insight into things and they're willing to share all of that with every one of their colleagues. Uh, it's very enriching. You know, I leave a better orthodontist every time I've ever attended a forum.